Hello everybody, welcome to Season Shredders. Today I'm going to show you my shower that I have on my Honda Element. It's my 2007 SC Honda Element. And I have this solar shower that I have built. And I've attached it to the roof rack. I designed it so that it's actually very easy to fill without having to reach too high. So I put the little rake on the top of here so I can reach it with my hands so everything's close here. And then as well as the bottom and the water drains down. Honda Elements have a tendency of having the roof and the front higher than the back, which causes the pipe to want to fill towards the front. I designed the shower with a tire valve right here on the end. When I fill it with water, I go ahead and tighten it down. I use a Ryobi pump that I just bought. It's like $30 for the pump. Works really well. You have to buy your own battery for it. It has a digital display on the back side. I usually put about 20 PSI when I'm using the shower. So, when I get ready to fill the air tank up, I go ahead and remove the cap. Just put that in my pocket because I always seem to lose it. I go ahead and just put the tire valve, the tire hose on. And I go ahead and I charge it. It feels pretty good about it. pretty loose right now so you can see the bubbling going on I need to tighten it back down but anyways that's how I fill the tank with pressurized air to get the water out so right now the air tank has about 10 psi and I go ahead and just go ahead and open my valve up down here to let the water flow just go ahead and pull everything off here and that's it now it doesn't have a lot of pressure, so I'll go ahead and I'll pressurize it out. So right now it has about 15 PSI. It worked well. Does what you need. About three and a half gallons in here to get a good shower when you're out in the forest or you're camping. And that's about it. That works really good. I just went ahead and built a just went ahead and built a shower curtain to go around. You want to take a shower and you're not in a very private place, so I just went and built a shower uh, curtain rod that's gonna add the shower curtain to it. But anyways, that is it. Go ahead and drain it out. I need to drain the water anyways for my last trip. Three and a half gallons, it gets you pretty far.